Hello everybody, welcome to a plugin overview. I'm going to be showing you how mob name renames mobs because I've seen quite a few, few um, people who've been wondering how do I set a mob's custom name and this is a 1.5 feature by the way so you won't be able to do it in any other version. So let's start with how this works. So this stuff up here just checks if you have the right permission. And this here checks if you're looking at an entity. I don't think you would want to know how this works, but what it does is it gets everything nearby, loops through it, and compares their X to the players, and if they're close enough, it'll return it. So that's a quick overview of that. So how does it rename it? It gets the mob, then it sets the custom name, and then sets it visible. If it's not visible, you won't be able to see the name. Um, could not rename. Um. So, if the name's bigger than 64, because the client can crash if it, the name's too long. So this is just a simple save your life check. Um, and this here gets the name of the mob, because basically what it does is it gets the class, so it's going to be like craft sheep or something like that, and then just replace craft to say sheep. Um, I'll show you in game how this works, and that's basically the code. So you just want to call any living entity set custom name blah and say it visible so I'll show you in game uh, I just need to start my server come on come on server there we are okay um I remember logging out in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, you can hear the... the was just loading. Okay, so I'll show you how this works. So if we type mn troll, you'll see that the name troll appears above his name, and it says rename zombie to troll. And that's just basically how it works. You can rename any living entity. And I've added support for colors. Basically, it just replaces the and sign with the chat color code. So cool. Oops. Helps if I. Oh. We named spider to. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> I really shouldn't pick that code because it's hard to see. So that's basically a plugin overview of how mob name works. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm currently looking for suggestions of tutorials to do, so if you have any requests, please leave them down below, and I'll be sure to try and do any requests that I get. Thank you for watching.